Howdy folks, welcome to episode 20. Today we're going to continue where we left off and I want to show you that we have, I bought the Shielded Livermorium and the Primary Praseodymium because we are going to go all the way over to here and this place wants both of those. So we can make a little bit of, a little bit of money uh, bringing stuff back there. So we're going to do that. And so yeah, we're just going to take off. I don't think anybody wanted to ride here. Let's see. We should, yeah, we should have plenty of, yep, we've got plenty of, of uh, vertical here. There we go. The question is how we get around this, right? And are we still at, yes, we are. We're still at 1,500. So we're going to go like this. We're going to go over this way. And try to skirt between the mountain and the, the volcano here. <laughs> the mountain and the geyser. There we go. Through the smoke and everything. All right. And yeah, we're going to head this way. Come on. And we'll go like this. Get our flaps. No, we don't need the flaps. We're good without the flaps. There we go. All right. So yeah, I think we can make it through here. Ooh, look, we got some calm air even. That's pretty cool. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So yeah, we're going to head over to the, the whatever it was, the one that's next to the big crater mine. I forget what it's called. Power station? Yeah, the power station. Because some like it hot. <laughs> and uh, yeah. So yeah, we're going to sell that stuff and then we'll go see what they want as far as the mission at the Big Crater Mine. And we'll go from there. So, yeah. Um, and I know a lot of, uh, not a lot, but a few people have, um, there we go, there's the big the big one. A few people have said they want longer episodes, and um, so I'm trying to go closer to 30 minutes. Um, I, you know, I, I know a lot of people like 40, 45 minute episodes too. The problem with that is that YouTube doesn't do the auto captions after you get past uh, 30 minutes, it won't do auto captions for videos that are longer than 30 minutes. And I get people that are not, um, you know, that are not native English speakers or whatever that have, you know, that want to use the captions, that, that get help from the captions and stuff. And, you know, and I know they're often wrong too, but it still helps, I'm sure. So, um, yeah, because I've had people complain about that and somebody actually accused me of, of Hating Latinos because I turned the captions. I didn't even know the captions were off, but he was like, he apparently thought this was something specifically against Latinos is why I turned the, <laughs> the captions off. Apparently only Latinos read captions or something. I don't know. But uh, yeah, it's like, no, I don't hate Latinos, dude. I mean, come on. I even took Latin in high school. Joke. Yes, it's a joke. I'm making fun of Dan Quayle. Okay, so anyway. <laughs> but yes, I am a nerd. I did take Latin in high school. And no, it's not the same as Spanish. Shh. <laughs> you ruin the joke when you have to explain it. Uh, okay. So anyway, we're gonna we're gonna go over here. The joke is that I'm dumb over here there we go drop a little bit we'll come in sideways there we go come on I can't believe the wind is not helping me out here help me out wind help me out help me out wind come on you can do it there we go there we go whoa the wind is wow the wind is blowing way this way and I, I like how that's going opposite directions, <laughs> but you know what I mean, it's like the wind is going way that way, and then when I get to the ground, it's like reversing it. I wonder if the ground effect just reverses uh, something. Yeah, I don't know. I have to check that out. But yeah, it just seemed odd that I was going the other way. Okay, so we're gonna sell both of these. We're gonna get gas while we're doing that. Yeah, flying flying a little too fast breaks my ship, but but. Landing like that didn't do anything. <laughs> didn't show me any damage anyway. Okay, we're going to sell that. 
and then once we sell that we can get going we'll see what this passenger wants if they're going anywhere we're already going so we can go like this and where did this person want to go where were they going again I really wish they'd show that oh my radar did take some damage but that was from the ski level thing it, it's not gonna say is it it's gonna wait it's gonna wait for me to is it that is it that I thought I thought it opened my thing huh see where they wanted to go there uh, research platform E no nope not going there all right and then which way is the wind blowing here not not really anywhere okay so we should be fine I just didn't want to run into that stuff over there all right we'll do this and we'll take the yeah, see it's going that way that's fine we don't need that much altitude there we go wow look at that they did build some stuff check it out that's pretty cool see where the landing is now where is the landing it's still the same spot okay we're gonna go over here that's really cool that's encouraging I I was half expecting nothing to happen so I'm really happy with this result all right we're gonna have to work our way in here it should be nice and calm though once we get down here go and let's come down a little bit it's gonna be fun trying to get out of here you drop off the next thing and it builds a dome over the top of you and you can't take off game over <laughs> okay there we go I still need to get used to how much throttle does what on this particular configuration it's a little bit different the authorities instructed Build radars around. These things are heavy. Could you help me deliver to materials construction site? Um, yeah, we can do that. We need to drill site north. So, which materials? Yeah, I can help you to deliver the materials, but which ones is the question. Use service drones? Because he wanted me to... What does he want me to do? I guess we're just gonna have to. We're just gonna have to buy the. Um, they want the uh, the metal plastic structural. For, oh, it's right there. Okay, there's a box right there. That isn't one that I dropped off, is it? No, nope, building materials right over here. Okay, cool. So we're gonna go over here. We're gonna get the building materials. Let's see, can we? Yeah, we can go over there. All right, we can taxi. Taxi our way over. And I think we're going to back in. I think we're going to back in because otherwise it's going to be too much trouble. And they have to do the turnaround Austin Powers style thing, you know? Let's see. <laughs> I had to do that the last time I came out of the... Uh, uh, at the end of the last episode, actually, after the came out of the repair shop, I had to go get more fuel. So I had to do the whole you know, turn around for five minutes thing. You know, go two inches forward, go two inches backward, go two inches forward. Come on, you can do it. And we're gonna go like this. And we're gonna bring this back. I'm just hoping my engine doesn't clip that little thing there. There we go. There it is. All right, so we're gonna pick that up there we go that's up cool is it gonna be like really it's gonna be like really fragile or anything no it looks like it's not really fragile it's 11 tons okay flight data received where do we need to bring it where do we need to bring it where is our flight data it says building materials for radar let's see where it is I don't want to take off without knowing where this is gonna be Do you see <laughs> I don't see it anywhere huh it's 
it's not showing up anywhere. Okay, well, we're just going to have to... I guess we are going to just have to take off. All right, let's go like this. And let's see, what do we have up here? Where can we even get out of this place without crashing into the walls? I think right up here. So we're going to try that. There we go. And let's see if we can find where we're supposed to go with this. 20.5 landing zone. Okay, it's showing us directly ahead. We're going to go like this. Just need to be very careful. Okay, there we go. All right, we're good now. And the ski level went way up, so we should be good to go that way. Where is it? 20... Where's it where's it showing? Cause it's just Oh, here it is. Okay. The landing zone was the uh the next target I had set or something. Cause that's not twenty kilometers. Deliver materials here. Cool, and they give you a timer for it too. Alright, so we've got our wind is going this way. Okay, I don't need that in my face for right now. Come on. Gonna drop a little bit. There we go. The wind should help us slow down here. There we go. Does anyone up for the race? There we go. We'll keep our momentum. I really want to test my new ship's performance. Should be able to cancel it fairly quickly here. There we go. I think I'm going to need to turn around, aren't I? In order to deliver, deliver the materials. We're going to have to turn around. Okay, stop spinning. There we go. There we go. Okay, so let's see where is the deliver the materials here. Okay, so we're going to open up the gate and we're going to back up. Whoa, apparently it just did it right, right when I opened it up. Okay, go back to the base for the following cargoes. Do not worry about it as soon as you deliver all the... Oh, nah, transfer the credits to your account. Okay, fine. Apparently that was close enough. I didn't even hit the deliver button. I just hit the... <laughs> you know what I mean? I just hit the, uh, the open the gate button. Apparently I broke my landing gear. <laughs> Poor landing gear. <laughs> we hardly knew you. <laughs> and now it's watch is over <laughs> all right <laughs> let's go back for more materials i think we'll get some repair here too soon we go like this this is gonna be really fun landing here over and over isn't it there we go definitely got to make use of these cameras here for this there we go. We're going to do this. There we go. No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's try this again. I had to do a go around. Uh, there we go. That helps. I, it's just the angle. I can't tell my vertical very well. Didn't have very good vertical depth perception there. It was terrible. Okay. Much better. All right. All right. Let's do this. Let's go to the map and we'll get drone repair here. Um, there we go. We're gonna we're gonna get drone and refuel. Get repair and refuel here, and we'll do a couple more of these. However many, it's probably like four or five of them, I'll bet. Just like the other thing was. Okay, so now, there we go. All right. And if we go to back, yeah, it's back. Okay. Back into the left. Back into the left. Building materials. And we're going to go up. There we go. Up puts them down. Back opens the door. And closes the door. 
Okay, flight data received. And where is it? Is it the same place or what? Nope, deliver materials here. Okay, it's 3.2 kilometers. It looks like it's just the power station. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna go sneak out this same side over here. Let's see how much this one was. Yeah, 42. 42,000. We're not that heavy. Okay, we're gonna sneak around this beam here. There we go. All right. Whoa. <laughs> Try to fly like you're not an idiot. Try that sometime, right? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna adjust the throttle to keep our, yeah, to keep our altitude. Here we go. That's fine. Not even going that far enough for that to be an issue. Go. This is going to be one of those things where the places where they expect you to land are not friendly to landing. And so it's going to be real, uh, there's going to be a lot of damage happening, I think. <laughs> but that's fine. All right. We can call a drone from anywhere, even, you know, if we, right when we land and everything. All right. There we go. There's our ground effect. All right. We're good there, and let's open the gate. 2.3 meters. So this way. Is it going to let me do it? Let's see. Because it's showing orange. Oh, it's green now. All right. It's in place. Hey, last one. Cool. Cool. I'm cool with that. Only three of them. All right. We'll go back for the last one. I think we can turn off these two. And we'll see if we can maybe sneak through this side to have some fun here, right? We're gonna have some fun taking a shortcut through here instead of going around. Because <laughs> nothing could possibly go wrong with this scheme, right? What could possibly go wrong? I don't see what I didn't see what somebody just said. Go. We surely need more people for this job. Guys, please, I just had it. Can we surely need more people? Don't call me Shirley. Alright. Go. And we're gonna sneak over this way. Strafe over. There we go. There we go. Nice. Beautiful. Alright. Open the gate. Open the tailgate on our big woody wagon here. It'd be so awesome if you could make your own liveries for this and textures and stuff. I actually just did that in X-Plane. It's pretty fun. Can we zoom out at all? We can't zoom out. Wish we could zoom out. I swear you used to be able to. Oh, you know what? I'll bet it is... Yeah, if you do that, you can do that, but you can't... No, you can't zoom out anymore. Okay. Um, pick up. I swear you used to be able to zoom out. Maybe just because of where I am? I don't know. Okay, so let's find our target. Flight data received. Where is it? It's going to be like 20 kilometers away. Five kilometers. Okay. No problem. And we have plenty of fuel. We're good. Let's just go do it. Go. Come out this way. There we go. I can't see where the beam is behind me. Oh, there is no beam actually there. Okay. That's fine too. Where was it? Where's the deliver the cargo where? There it is. Okay. Other side of the mountain. All right. Let's do it. Go this way. Let's see what our wind is looking like. So what you can do in, in uh, 
VTOL mode here is you basically, if you have enough power, you'll climb. And so what you can do is you can just let off on the throttle in order to, um, you basically hold the joystick all the way forward and then you just use the throttle, you throttle down until you're not climbing or sinking anymore. There we go. Is this the same place as the other one or was that over there? I think it was over there. It's another one of these little islands here. Like this. Here. Don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> there we go. There we go, that should be good. Whoops. Open the doors and put it down, not back. Down. There we go. Alright. Great. 20,000. Uh, just bring the necessary goods. Cool. So we're going to, um, should we just repair from here and go get stuff? I think that's what we'll do is we'll call a drone and refuel from here. And then we will, uh, while we're waiting for that, we're going to mark uh, Raglor. See, they sold the other ones. They sold the other frames, and so they now only have the one type. Once they sell the one, they, they're out of it because they want... Yeah, they sold the carbon, so they need the metal plastic. Okay. And those are... How much? 11000 Yep, we've got money for it. Cool. Okay, let's do it. And Ragler should be on our map. Right? Whoops. Yep, it's... It's on there. There we go. And we're going to spin around here. Let's get going. We can turn that off for now. Let's see, there's the power station. Raglar is going to be up here. There we go. Went right past it, didn't I? All right, let's do it. Oops. Want that? 110, 20, 30, 40, 50. Okay, turn off the flaps. There we go. All right. So yeah, we've got another headwind. It's just like last time. All right, we were going to go up to. Because isn't the ski level way up at the 3,000 now? Which I think is the 2,500. But we'll see. We'll see what level it's at. Am I really using that much fuel? Wow. And we're going to try going around this way. And I think we'll slow down on the fuel consumption here. We don't need to go a zillion go. And we're going to hit this bigger headwind here. 2250. Cuz I think we're going to hit, yeah. Let's give ourselves about 6 minutes of fuel here. We'll back it down till we get to about 6 minutes of fuel. There we go. And we should be able to get up to 2500. Come on, 2,500. You can do it. We're going to go, we're going to pre-steer around this volcano. There we go. All right. Come on, you can do it. There we go. All right, we are good now. <laughs> and somehow I've managed to use the flaps the last few times without ripping them off the, ripping them off the wings. So... Got to be pretty proud of that. <laughs> All right, I don't think we need the wind. Yeah, I think I probably do want to make sure I'm not running into volcanoes and stuff. The wind really is pushing us off to the right. It's kind of interesting. I gotta say, it's, yeah, it's 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 making me steer right if I if I leave the controller alone if I don't twist on it. I'm really hoping they're gonna do. They're going to make it so that when you do this, it actually, uh, you know, turns. That's going to be really cool when they do that. Especially if it'll allow you to turn faster in airplane mode. The thing I've noticed, though, is if you watch here, it looks like 
the center of of rotation is not is not the ship. The center of rotation is like you're rotating about around about that spot. See, <laughs> maybe a little bit lower, maybe where the Ragnar transit transit sign is. Yeah, see, it's barely moving. It's just rotating. So yeah, it's like the the center of mass is apparently above the ship, which I'm not sure how that's works, but that may be why they don't have the uh, the roll axis doing the turning for you because they don't want the player rolling. I don't know. Because it doesn't seem to do that in the other mode. In, um, what is it called? The one that's not airplane mode. In VTOL mode, it doesn't seem to do that. So, 37 kilometers. We should be good on fuel. We need to get some more altitude, though. There we go. There we go. Twenty-three, twenty-four. Okay, we can let it stop climbing here. There we go. All right. Yeah, we seem to be doing okay on fuel and everything. I just gotta watch that. Do need to watch that. Come on. So yeah, I am not positive. I need to find out what these things are here. What all these little indicators is another one that comes down from the top and the bottom and stuff like that. I assume the one that's from the top is your uh, is your speed where you start taking damage, and the one from the bottom, you know, like with your flaps and stuff like that, where your wings start taking damage or whatever. And the one on the bottom is your stall speed. I would assume um, that's what it is in uh, airplanes like in the 737 that I've been doing in X-Plane. There we go. We're almost there. I think we can lay back on the throttle a little bit. Do we even have any? We don't have any cargo, so it's not like we have anything to worry about as far as that goes. Nope, we're just going here to get those metal, pl metal plastic structural frames, whatever they are. Ding! <laughs> foggy all of a sudden, isn't it? There we go. We're almost there. And we still have tons of fuel. Okay. I think I'm getting a better uh, hang of this. It seems to be about a thousand per ten. Each 10k takes about a thousand. Go. Use some flaps here. Go see if we can keep from losing altitude here. There we go. Took about half throttle. There we go. Let's go like this. All right, and we just need to land this thing. And it's always this tailwind. <laughs> It's always this tailwind, tailwind over here if you try to land. Oh, come on. Oh, that's why. I'm like, why am I not... Why am I not coming toward the landing zone? That would be why. <laughs> All right. I get this one mixed up with the other one, the security base, because it's a very similar layout, except the uh, the landing zone is over where those little towers are behind us. Danish level below two kilometers. Oh, that's going to be fun. It's going to make the return trip really fun, won't it? All right. Cool. I think we are here. We can do a little twist, twisty thing. Do the chubby checker. There we go. There we go. Yep, I hear it. All right, cool. Right, so that's going to be it for episode 20. Join me in episode 21. We are going to buy those thingies and bring them back and see what new cool new construction it does so yeah that's gonna be it for 20 we'll see you guys in episode 21 later <laughs>